Manufacturing is booming in the city of Springfield. 22 News anchor Tamara Sakarzik toured rail car maker CRRC, providing an inside look into one of the city's largest industrial developments in decades. We're honored to have the uh, North American headquarters of the largest railway manufacturing company in the world right here in our backyard. Inside this massive building on Page Boulevard, China-based rail car maker CRRC is putting Springfield back on the map for manufacturing. CRRC broke ground in Springfield in 2015, expanding their Chinese manufacturing empire into Springfield, creating nearly 200 jobs here. 22 News took the hard hat tour of this massive 204,000 square foot facility with Mayor Dominic Sarno. Seeing this in action, I'm sure that this just gives you a lot of hope for the future of Springfield. Oh, sure. Sure it does. During its golden age, Springfield was a hub for manufacturing. The city became home to the National Armory back in the 1700s and more than a century later, the Wasson Manufacturing Company. CRRC is a solid step for the city, restoring that reputation. They're going to be manufacturing well into 2025, if not longer. They have contracts in Philadelphia, Philly, and Los Angeles, uh, L.A., and they continue to pursue contracts all across North America. I know they're competing in Atlanta and other places now, so uh, we're very pleased to, to have them. CRRC has an $843 million contract with the MBTA, Boston's mass transit agency. 22 News got a look at the first four rail cars that will be shipped to Boston by the end of the year. Each car takes 22 days to make at a cost of $2.4 million. Yeah, you assemble the car, it's like a giant jigsaw puzzle, and all right. the pieces got to go in the right place, and in this case, in the right order. Once the parts come together, the cars undergo a series of tests on the facility's indoor rail. We finish assembling the car, slide it backwards, we'll weigh the car and balance the car, all four positions and then it'll go forward into the water test booth. So this is basically a utility track okay, for us. Okay, that's what I was going to ask. So that's a, the water test, so the yes. inclement type weather type oh, activities. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, oh. actually that simulates almost a category two, and if it's going to leak, it leaks. Once the rail cars pass the test, they'll be loaded onto special trailers and shipped off to Boston. CRRC won't move on to any other contracts until they've completed this contract for the rest of the MBTA cars. A major milestone for a city that's determined to rebrand and rebuild one project at a time. In Springfield, Tamara Sakarzik, 22 News.